everyone, it's Green K out here, back with more of like the Zelda Ocarina mean, of Time. Last part we got here, the Gone City, and found out that all the Gons were taken to the Fire Temple and are being fed to the Dragon Name of Vogue. And in this episode, we're gonna head towards the file, the fire file. Yeah, so we're gonna head towards the file, the filing cabinet. We're gonna head towards the Fire Temple and do something about it. And if you notice. We have no timer, that means this is heat resistant. Obviously. So what you want to do here is pull your hook shot, and if you notice, the heart container is still. Um Yeah. I forgot to plant a seed here as a kid. No clue where the fuck you plant it. But anyways, enough of that, let's just continue on this way. Sheik's here? But he can't! He's not wearing a friggin' fire resistant tunic like I am! It is something that grows over time. A true friendship. A feeling in the heart that becomes even stronger over time. The passion of friendship will soon blossom into a righteous power and through it, you will know which way to go. This song is dedicated to the power of the heart. Listen to the bol bolero of fire. I really like this song a lot. They should make a duet. Oh wait, they just did. You have learned the bolero of fire. Link, I'll see you again. A fire barrier! And she's gone. You think the bridge would burn, and the fire went out. But still, you think the fridge... Yes, the fridge would burn. No, the wood will burn. But anyways, forget what's over there. You know, totally on there. Oh, whoa, don't roll off the side. Oh wait. Oh, I know it's just the entrance to the fire temple. So yeah. Nice one. Anyways, heading towards the fire temple. Yeah. Welcome to the Fire Temple, the fifth dungeon of the game. If you notice, there'll be a couple fire keys. I just ignore them and hit the door on the left. As soon as you do, you'll get a cutscene. Oh my god, it's Theronia. He's grown more hair. Kinda. Who's there? Is that you, Link? Oh, it really is Link. You've grown so big since I, since I last saw you. I want to have a man-to-man -man talk with you, but now is not the time. Ganondorf is causing trouble on Del Death Mountain again. He has revived the evil ancient dragon, Volvagia. On top of that, he's, go he's going to feed my people to that evil dragon, as a warning to other races that might resist him. If that fire raven dragon escapes from, Death Mountain, from the mountain, all of Hyrule will become a burning wasteland. I will go on ahead to try to steal up the evil dragon. I'm concerned, though, because I don't have that legendary hammer, but I have no choice. Link, I'm asking you to do this as my sworn brother. While I'm trying to deal with the dragon, please save my people. The prisoner's cells are in the opposite direction. I'm counting on you, Link. Wait, how did he get in? He doesn't even have the boss key. Eh. Okay, so, starting off here, what I'm going to do is go to the left. And, oh, but we're going to make that for a second. So, step on the switch, and the Goron is free. Are you releasing me? Am I free to go? I'll tell you a secret for saving me. 
In order to get into the room where the Deronia went, you have to do something about the pillar stuck in the ceiling. Find a path that leads to a room above the ceiling right away. So yeah. You know it's the chest behind the gun. If you open it, you get a small key. Let's uh this early in the temple, we're all getting small key. We're already getting the small key. Go figure. Coming across here. And we're gonna come across to the other side this time. I think. No, we're not. We're gonna go at we're actually gonna head out this door. Anyways, continuing on. Opening this door here, and we'll get into another section of the dungeon. Of the, of the dungeon. Um, go that way. Moving platform. Whoa! It's thinking. We're gonna go through this door. First. See guys, there's another gar on here. That we're gonna release. Talk to him again. Are you releasing me? I am not free to go. Here's the secret for saving me. A wall that you can destroy with the Goron special crop will sound different than a regular wall if you hit it with your sword. If you're wondering what he's talking about with the special crap crop, he's talking about the bomb flower, so we have bombs, so let's look out for that. If you notice there's a chest here like four and I believe it's another small key. Yep. Alright, so heading out again. You notice on top on the top here there was a um time stone thingy. Play the song of time and it will move it. You think it's gonna disappear? Well no it's not. You're just pretty much teleporting it. Do that reveals another door. Inside here. Evil pillars. Eh. They're all evil. Burn it with fire. You notice that enemy there is called a like like. They will destroy your If you get you they'll pro try to suck you up and in doing so they will steal your stuff. They're really annoying and I hate them so very much. Oh. But reward They gave us sixty rupees. Holy shit. And we get another token. That's uh I'm going out here. I'm gonna head towards the other side this time. Look, we are invincible. We can walk walk on lava. I think our feet would burn instantly. Now well, that's compl well, that's completely obvious. And the fire keeps chasing us. But you don't stay on that ladder for too long because you'll take damage eventually. This is compl this is totally obvious. We cannot break our sword. And I walk into the ex explosion. And there is another gone to save, and another chest is there as well. Are you releasing me? Am I free to go? I'll tell you a secret for saving me. Blah blah blah. There are switches in this temple that you have to cut 
to activate, but you can also use the Goron special crop to do the job. And he left. Get to the damn chest! Thank you. And we get another small key. So yeah, very nice. Now we're gonna go to the north part of this room. So, we're gonna walk across the lava. Because we're badass like that. Walking along, don't fall. And open the door. This room... I don't like all that much. What you're supposed to do is... Jump across here and... Voila! I believe there's a skatoa in this room, I'm not too sure. Or Keith. Why couldn't I jump? Arrows! Go over here and push this block very slowly. Any day now, Link. While I'm young, I'm not that young. I'm not that old either. And in doing so, will cause that fire to that you know, thing go over the fire. And we're now up. Go to the store and. A new area. Random frame rate, slow down. Notice it's gone there, but this is the switch is on the other side. We'll get to him in a we'll get to him in a bit later. Thing there that we have to carry. Those things are called slugs. Porch slugs, sorry. Come on. There. Not that hard. I I just ignore them. Oh, you bitch, you actually hit me. Die. Punishment is death. Welcome to die. Death. Population death. What I do is... Over here and push this block. And, yeah. Check this one, see if I did that wrong. Pull it. Four, five, six. Okay. Climb up here. Jump across. Climb up some more. Now what you're supposed to do is you know, there's a fire block in this well, What you're supposed to do is... Oh. We blow up our faces, apparently. Put a bomb down there, climb back up, and when the thing is close, it's gonna activate that switch. Thing is, that switch doesn't stay activated for very long. So, you have as much time as you can and climb up here. See, if we hit that switch from with our sword, we wouldn't have been able to make that. So after you're done doing what I just showed, open the door. And we get into some maze-like area. Um, go. And there's boulders everywhere. And we get hit, apparently. And the boulders will go in reverse. How very fitting. Go through here, there's a Goron! And another chest. Yeah, 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 I'll tell you a secret for saving me! In this temple, there are doors that fall down when you try to open them. When one of these doors starts to fall, move! If you use a sample of the Goron special crop, you can break it. Yeah, another hint. 
Open up, go up to the chest and pick it open and we get another key. I guess all the keys we found so far are chests in with the Goron. So this this is Katoa up for grabs in this area and so we're gonna go grab it and not get hit by the boulder. Go in. Oh I thought there was a door there! Wow, you are an ass. I was in the wrong area apparently. Um, yeah, we're gonna go find that Katoa. Yeah, fuck you, I win. Aha! There's a locked door here. Open it and... We're in an annoying little area. We're actually gonna use the bow for one. Parts I'm missing, if you fall down there, you don't die, but it just leads you to... Um, a lower area of the dungeon, but yeah, our bow and switch, and doing that opens that door. Um, trying to fall here, and go through the door. And if you go to your left, there's a big ass chest means it's gonna probably contain the dungeon map in it. And I was correct! Yes, so we got the, now we got the dungeon map, so I'm now I'm gonna show you a little area of this dungeon. Dungeon's five floors, we're currently on the third floor. So yeah. It looks kinda complicated to be honest. And so yeah, after you've done that, go back to the door and can't do anything about that door yet. So let's head on back to the door into the maze. Isn't that just amazing? Yes. Let's actually find a guitar this time. Door here. There's a door somewhere. Now I'm curious. Um, what if I? Aha! I see you. Aha! I noticed that. Like I said, there was. Hit the damn spider! Holy shit. Yes. And after you're done there, um, don't get hit by the boulder. Boulder. Yes, I'm calling, I'm calling them a Pokemon now. <sighs> Anyways, go to the store. But, I think that's enough for this episode, so next time on Legend of Zelda we're going to continue through the Fire Temple, so see you guys then.